It's the first day of the seventh annual Muhammad Ali Festival, marking the anniversary of his passing and celebrating him worldwide and his impact. Wave News reporter Josh Ninke has more from the Ali Center. There's so much happening with the Ali Festival and it all kicks off today. I've got Annie here to tell us a little bit more about what's going on. So what's happening today? So we have the Daughters of Greatness Breakfast Series where we honor women who are carrying forward Muhammad's legacy. And today we're honoring Lenita Baker, who is president of the Bar Association and uh, Brianna Taylor's family's attorney for the important work she's doing. Yeah. And then uh, later this evening, we have Muhammad's eldest daughter, Miriam Ali, and she will be on site to tell us what it was like to be raised by the champ. And she's already previewed some stories. I can't wait to hear. That's so cool. What a special chance for people to get to see that. Uh, you guys also have so much going on, 11 days worth of things. So uh, what are just a few of the other things you want to mention? Um, so we have the community carnival on Sunday. We're really hoping the community will come out and join us. They can get into the exhibits for free. We will have games and prizes and food trucks and carnival performers and crafts, something for everybody at that one. And then this Thursday is the big community volunteer opportunity with the greatest give back. And that's our partnership with Metro United Way. Uh, so what are you guys doing with, uh, what are you putting in the backpacks? So we'll put in some notebooks, pens, pencils, folders, um, you know, things for kids going back to school. And then we'll also have healthy snack kits for people in our community experiencing homelessness that will, you know, really help them get a little nutrition. And for folks who want to volunteer and be part of this, how do they sign up for that? So you can head to our uh, website, ollifest.org, and get all the information there as well as the rest of the events throughout the week. Fantastic. And you guys can find that link at wave3.com right now because let me tell you, there is so much happening over the next 11 days. You do not want to miss it. Here in Louisville, Josh Stinky, Wave News.